Hey, this is Steven with Greenbrier Percussion, here to talk to you about this Star Classic Babinga kit made by Tama. The reason I chose to play a little ostinato pattern to start off here and rocked out a little at the end is to show you that these drums really carry tone without having overtones, crazy ring problems. They're really tight and controlled, which is what you get out of a hardwood-like Babinga. A little more volume than the maple or poplar shells are used to on lower-end poplar or professional maple kits. You get a lot of the warmth of maple, but it's a, a tighter, controlled, shorter sound. The die-cast hoops that come with this kit, which are a very expensive upgrade, really help focus that sound into the attack, which gives you that striking note, boom, out of your toms. Even out of your snare, when you have the snare wire switched off, you get a really clean, concise tone. So if you're a drummer that wants to pull a lot of musicality out of your drum set, Babinga is perhaps the best choice of wood for you. A lot of mid-range means you can tune these high, medium, and low, get a lot of different good pitches and ranges out of your toms, depending on what kind of preference you like in your setup, and uh, the drums will still sound good no matter what tuning range you really want to put them in. The snare is really crisp, very pingy. It's very bright out near the edge, very deep and dark near the center of the snare. I enjoy that a lot because I can get a lot of different sounds out of it, which I'll show you as I play more in just a second here. I really like the Star Classic uh, mounting system here you get that's you know wrapped right around the hoop without any extra holes drilled in your shell to allow the babinga to really stand out and resonate. And I love the new Tama Tom holder that allows the toms to get a little closer to you than you usually get when you have a mount drilled into your bass drum. So if you'd like to know more about this kit, check out the specs that are on our ad. Note that the symbols and hardware are not included with the kit. They're sold separately. I chose Peisty Dark Energy to play because they're dry and pair really well with Babinga. Anywho, enjoy the video. Hope you like the way this kit sounds.